John and Barbara Wilkerson have a strong passion for the arts and have helped share that love throughout their lives. John is the immediate past president of the American Folk Art Museum in New York. Both have collected American folk art and have an interest in Australian Aboriginal art. They have collected paintings of the early works of Central and West Australia for the past 15 years, and their personal collection is currently on display at the Johnson Museum at Cornell University. When we went to the, uh, the Museum of Darwin, we both fell instantly in love with it. Absolutely every picture in the room we loved. So then when we got to Sydney, we started to go to some of the galleries and we loved everything. And that's a bad way to be because you're not discriminating at all. We just loved everything. John was born and raised in Elko, Nevada. Upon graduating high school, he attended Utah State University and in 1965 received his bachelor's degree in biological sciences. When I left, the seed had been planted. And so anything that uh, I think that has uh, worked well on the professional side of my life and many of the things, uh, accomplishments that Barbara and I've had on the personal side of our life have evolved because we've been able to develop a framework to approach things using th this, these different thought tools and uh, Utah State was, was fantastic. Uh, professor after professor, assistant after assistant in challenging and, and moving that process. He continued his education at Cornell University in Ithaca, New York, and received both a master's and a doctorate. It was there that he met Barbara. The first date was the best date I ever had. We just laughed the whole time. He's just incredibly honest and he's a good, kind person. John's career began at Johnson & Johnson, where he was a top-rated health industry analyst in 1998, he was the founder of the Wilkerson Group, a leading healthcare consultancy acquired by IBM. John is a co-founder of Galen Partners, which provides expansion capital to growing medical companies, and today has a billion dollars under management. The Wilkersons are conservationists and co-founders of the E.L. Rose Conservancy in Northern Pennsylvania. If you can find one area that you're passionate about, whether it be something that's totally insignificant to others or everybody's concerned about it, just identify it and jump in and experience a journey. Be part of the journey and in as much of a leadership fashion as you're capable of. In line with their love of the land, they are both gardeners. Barbara's landscapes and plants have won several major awards, including the coveted blue ribbon at the Philadelphia Flower Show. Together, they have three children. John and Barbara returned to campus in March 2008, where John spoke to faculty and students about the university and the values it instilled in him while he was a student. Uh, focus on leadership and being learning to be a change agent in whatever field you choose, whether it be liberal arts, uh, art science, uh, sports, but understand that people have to change things to make progress. In a group at any point in our life, we want to move the world forward and we can do it in baby steps or we can do it in giant steps, but sometimes it's a power of idea that is transformational but 98% of the time, it is an element of leadership. 